Hey everyone, it's Tyler, the Antenna Man, and today I'm going to set up and review this Channel Master ATSC HD modulator. This is a professional grade encoder designed to distribute video from an HDMI device over coax to multiple TV sets alongside existing over the air and cable channels. There are many uses for this encoder, including making your own closed circuit TV station. Stay tuned to learn more. If you're seeing me for the first time, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that little bell icon to receive a notification whenever I post a new video. As a heads up, this video is proudly sponsored by Channel Master. So this HD modulator sends video from an HDMI device to multiple TV sets by coax. In a business setting, it could be used to send a video loop, slideshow, or CCTV station over all TVs. In a residential setting, it could be used to access a security camera system on all the TV sets in your home. It can also be used to set up a whole home streaming system using a Fire Stick or Roku, which is personally what I'm using it for. The HD modulator allows you to assign a specific RF and virtual channel so it won't interfere with your existing over-the-air or cable channels. If you decide to purchase this really cool HD modulator, be sure to follow my affiliate link in the pinned comment or description of the video to help support my YouTube channel. In this demonstration, I'll be using a laptop to broadcast my outdoor antenna review playlist to all the TV sets in my home. Setup is pretty easy. First, connect your video source to the HDMI input. In my case, it's a laptop. The coax cable coming from your antenna or cable connects to the RF input connector, and then the cable going to your TV sets gets connected to the RF output connector. You're able to configure some settings right on the modulator itself, such as the RF channel and how much to attenuate the default 30 dB output. I found the best attenuation for my situation was around negative 25 dB since some of my over-the-air channels were over-amplified when the modulator was at full power. Once I had the HD modulator configured, I ran a channel scan on my main TV set. Sure enough, there was my channel alongside all my other over-the-air channels. Note that any compression you see on the TV is from the YouTube stream and not from the modulator itself. The channel name defaults to show name. You can easily change this along with other advanced settings by connecting the modulator to your internet modem and typing in the IP address on any web browser. For some reason, my web browser kept changing the IP address that was listed on the modulator. If this happens to you, remove the first set of three zeros in the IP address and you should be able to access it. I set the RF channel to 37 since it's never been used for television. I also changed the virtual channel to 37 since it will default to 2 and there's already a channel 2 in my area. I named the channel Antenna Man. After the modulator was reconfigured, I rescanned my TV set. When I flipped through the channel, sure enough, there was channel 37 broadcasting myself. I saw the same thing on the TV in my sunroom, minus the Antenna Man channel name since it's an older TV and only shows channel numbers. So this HD modulator worked exactly as it should. It pretty much allowed me to make my own CCTV station that could be picked up on all the TV sets throughout my house. This is perfect for a local business to show an event calendar or a video loop on multiple TV sets. And if you're not a business owner, you could still use this modulator connected to a security system or a fire stick to make a whole home streaming system. And as a bonus, if you have an over the air DVR, you can actually record directly off the fire stick with the help of this. Many live streaming and on-demand apps do not offer a DVR service, but if you were to use this modulator to put your Fire Stick on an RF channel, you could record off it. Now, some of you tech folks out there may be wondering, if this is an RF modulator with up to 30 dB output, could you technically connect the output to an antenna and sort of broadcast your video signal over the air on an ATSC channel that can be picked up by TV sets throughout your home? Maybe. I think most of you know the answer. For a limited time, you can get the Channel Master HD modulator for 10% off. Simply enter coupon code ANTMAN10 in the checkout. If you have any questions about this HD modulator, feel free to ask them in the comments. Thanks again for watching this YouTube video. An additional thanks to everyone who supports me on Patreon and is a member of my YouTube channel. If my videos have helped you cut the cord and you'd like to help support them, I'll gain exclusive perks such as behind the scenes content, access to my videos ad-free one day early, 
and direct contact with me, visit patreon.com forward slash antenna man or click the join button in this video. If you're on Facebook, you can like my Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash antenna man PA. If you're not on Facebook and would like to receive email updates when I post new videos, feel free to sign up to my email list. I attach a link in the description of the video. Stay tuned to my YouTube channel for more cord cutting and antenna related videos and have an awesome day.